some reason, my tormentor didn't require a hand job. Possibly because he had already compelled another small boy to give him one. He loaned me to one of his two friends and I was obliged to service them instead. This man, and although it is tempting to name him, I am not going to, was, I think, the only genuinely immoral person I've ever met. Towards the end of our time together, he compelled me to agree to meet him in a public toilet in the cemetery on the outskirts of Shrewsbury, where he raped me. Oddly enough, much as I hated the experience, I think I had become so accustomed to systematic sexual abuse that I wasn't especially traumatized by the experience.